Greetings to my team of 144, all star seeds, love workers, and way showers. It is 952019, 909 p.m. The 999 is coming through. Today, we are being prepared for the 999 portal, which will be Moon Day. This coming Moon Day, where I will start training the Divine 44 to be fully activated on this great mission that is ahead. To help all of humanity through this ascension process. Also today, 73 was coming through all morning. 37, there are so many synchronicities today. I could spend an hour talking about them. But I'm going to try to make this as brief as possible. Because we have several updates and transmissions. With the 73 energy and the 17. From the 14th to the 17th. The 14th is the full moon coming up the 99 portal into the 14th more massive waves more activations and i'll keep you updated as i connect with the divine 44 with each connection and transmission that i will be doing this coming week it'll just keep building these energies these event energies are just going to keep building stronger and stronger as we make these connections and then Possibly at the end of the month, I'll try to get together as many of the Divine 44 to do maybe a live event or do some kind of connection where I can post it to this channel. Because I already feel the power coming in, the energy, the love, just through the communications I've made so far and the connections. It is 911. So today, with the 73 coming in, on the 17th of this month, my mother, who's Virgo of the Waters, will be turning 73. And those of you that have been following my channel for a while know the 73, the significance, the 37 is Earth, the 73 is Heaven. So to me, the 73 symbolizes Heaven on Earth. And it also just happens to be the year that my mother gave birth to this avatar, to this vessel. On 5101973, the five elements, the ten organs. It's also the same birth date as Sri Yukteswar, which is one of Paramahansa Yogananda teachers, one of the living masters of the Kriya Yoga, the Kriya Yoga sect, and also Guru Raj, who's still a living master. He wrote a book about Baba G, which is the living avatar, the living master that started the the immortal that started the Kriya Yoga lineage, which I've trained briefly in that in the past, also with the Ashtanga Yoga. But the art that I'm teaching now, I, it's a combination of many things. I teach everything from Qigong, Neigong, to ecstatic body postures and healing energy work. I My root, my foundation I teach is the Neigong, the Kunlun, through Ching Feng Dao Shur, Sifu Max, which is what I'll be teaching to the Divine 44, and then the Sacred 77, which will be a team of 144 light workers, love workers, which I'll be opening registration for that soon. Post a video here in the near future, but also with the 17th, the 1 7. So there are so many shifts, changes, accelerations that are happening right now. I'm sure many of you are experiencing this, these great life changes, these pathways opening up as these energies are coming in fully. The other day when my shirt was covered with all these burrs, I ended up throwing it out. And the only shirt that I had at my shop was one that my sister made when my beloved nephew, James, passed away. She made these shirts with his birth date and transition date and his car it was like a symbol of his car that you know was meant everything to him this hot rod car that he put thousands and thousands of dollars into it was like an image of that and then say james bizzle and his birth date and i've never wore this shirt before it was the first time i wore it and i really felt a deep connection to him which in one of my past videos, I talked about when I visited him on the other side in the higher realms and 5D and beyond. It was the most beautiful imagery that I've ever seen with the rainbow clouds, the rainbow waves coming in when I told him how beautiful it was there and what you would call heaven or 5D. 
12D, whatever. He just smiled and looked at me and said, you ain't seen nothing yet. And brothers and sisters, we have not seen anything yet. These, what is coming is beyond imagination. And it is great beauty, love, truth. Not some fantasy, but the great beauty of source will be fully manifest. That will be the new earth. We are going to manifest the new earth. So I, I'm not very good with dates, you know, times and dates. There's just too many things to remember. And I didn't remember his transition date, my nephew James. And on the shirt, it was 5-1714, May 17th, 2014. It is now 917. So this 17th is September on my mother's birthday. It's another massive portal. That will lead into the equinox energies, the division, the zero point, the center. A friend of mine came by today to my shop and I was helping him out to get, uh, put together a CD of a crime that happened to him several years ago, which injured him. It was a crime that was committed. I'm not going to mention what it was because it was heinous and it's not necessary, but when he was... Let's just say he was attacked by several people. And under that attack, he had head trauma, severe head trauma, and he had a near-death experience. And I saw it on the paper because I asked him. I saw the doctors, one of the forms, because he's in a lawsuit with these people, that on, on the doctor's report, he said that my friend had an NDE. And I asked him, why did the doctor say that? And he said, because when... He had such extreme head trauma that he left his body. You know, he had told the doctor, you know, I was hovering above my body and seeing these people, at you know, attacking him. And then the next image I opened, because he was looking at the images and the PDFs and the documents of, like, witnesses and so on, and images of him, which were very brutal, which I was troubling to see. This image popped up, and it was he said he was going to make T-shirts of it. And it was like two arms with chain around them and this like bars in this window with light coming through. And it said something like, when justice is served, you'll know that, I can't remember the exact quote, but it had something to do with these people that attacked him once justice is served, that things will be made right, something like that. And underneath this window with the light, it said 517 you know, 5-17-14. And I said, what's that date? And he said that was the night that he was attacked when he had the near-death experience. And I had told him that my nephew had passed at that on that same day. You know, this is just a major synchronicity that happened today that a lot of people like to hear these stories. Some people, not so much, but that's okay. Because I, I do these transmissions for people that, that, you know, will get benefits from it. If it doesn't things I do or say or teach don't resonate then that's okay too you can just you can move on and go to the next thing so when he he asked me about what time he passed and then we we don't know because it was overnight but I said it was sometime before midnight potentially and he said that's the time that this event occurred to him when he had this near-death experience so I've been really connecting with my nephew my sister's son James, in these last few days, I've been I had that shirt on earlier today, which really made me see that day because I haven't been able to wear it, but I really felt this deep connection to him today. And then he brought to me my friend that I'm trying to help with this this case, I'm trying to connect him with some friends in the legal field, we should say. Because of the corrupt system, justice was not served, but it will be. Because justice is coming for all beings and all life. Great balance is coming and the great shift. So today's first transmission from Michael Love and the Pleiadians. The event, powerful plasma blasts, continue to impact Earth. 9052019 great one are you still feeling the incredible levels of central sun plasma light coming into the planet over the last 12 hours light forces bombarded the 3d matrix with powerful 40 hertz 5d central sun gamma blasts also at approximately two hours ago 
The 3D timeline was completely collapsed for several minutes and as it merged onto the 5D timeline. These brief timeline shifts are not 100% sustained yet and are quick dimensional on and offs for the purpose of slowly stabilizing the new 5D energy around the planet. What is a timeline shift and why does it show up in the energy around planet Earth? A timeline shift is a literal, temporary state where the universe reverts back to a quantum zero time and zero matter state. The dark matter point detected in the energy of the cosmos, the black line on the Schumann graph, shows the switched off state. Human level consciousness usually has no awareness or recollection of these timeline shifts. However, very aware beings notice that something shifted and changed and that reality was reset. If you look very, very close at your reality after one of these resets, material things now exist that never existed before, or a thing that you remember existed now never happened. It can be a bit perplexing to wrap your mind around this, but it is a very real phenomena that billions of people notice. The Mandela Effect attempts to illustrate these radical timeline anomalies. These resets are positive and are required to shift from one dimension up to a fast vibrating one. This is all being orchestrated by intelligent, benevolent, benevolent forces who are doing advanced technical work in etheric realms to assist humanity in their grand evolution. Starseed Ascension symptom reports are still in an elevated status. Be sure to deploy protocol PB Stardust to aid your light body. You can find PB Stardust information in our previous broadcast. Let us know what ascension symptoms you may be experiencing. And that is the code command PB Stardust. Many of you are already using that code for healing, for transformation. The galactics say we are on upward path now as this realm is being completely overtaken by blinding white magnetic central sunlight. This gamma photonic light instantly activates dormant DNA strands to a higher order when it comes into contact with the human genome. A galactic newer civilization is being born right now and the 4.5 billion starseeds of this planet shall guide this new heaven on earth forevermore. It is your paradise and this new world, such beautiful and amazing things will all be possible for you. Dear one, it is time to say goodbye to those old lower things and come up to higher as the new earth continues to emerge from the ether. You have to let it all go now, make a major shift in your life and start living in a natural and authentic way. Take good care of you and your, do your inner work more than ever now. The Earth Alliance will be passing along several, several major updates as we move towards a high vibe galactic weekend. So stand by for super awesomeness. This is truly the greatest time in human history and is what we have worked towards for eons. Throat chakra is opening up here. Phew. A new day is finally dawning on planet Earth. And you are the bringer of it all. Thank you for your great service to all of humanity. Godspeed. Michael from 5DEarthProject.com Today from Gaia Portal, the code for today, seeds of higher influence are sown. Emancipators of many vibrations collect the honeys from the flowers. Flashes of rainbow light are viewed. Petals of humanity mark the higher path. So that's part of the awakening, the opening of the petals of the flower, of the awakening of human consciousness. In the Buddhist tradition, this is symbolized by the lotus flower, the beautiful lotus. You'll, a lot of times you'll see images of the Buddha meditating on a lotus flower. These are the petals of the lotus. This is the chakras fully opening. The energies, the portals, the portals are fully open. The gateways are fully open now. From Elizabeth, Peru, we're inside the cosmic rectangle. 14 days of rare planetary alignments have begun. Are you feeling a heightened presence and simultaneous contraction in the air? For the first half of September 2019, we're operating under and indeed experiencing unprecedented energy times. If you're a subscriber to the tip off, I urge you to jump on line nine now or Read or listen to what I have to say about how to navigate every day this week with the Cosmic Rectangle. 
It's like a huge reality check for being authentic, slapping in our face while Earth is fielding the energetic lines of over five planetary bodies forming a giant energy rectangle in our skies. Just imagine sitting in the center of the Great Pyramid of Egypt for 14 days straight. That's what's happening now. You'll need to be aware and ready. We had just had the strongest solar storm of 2019. It's no surprise to me that over the past seven days, as August transitioned into September, we've had two Earth-directed solar storms, and the last one, over 24 hours ago, was the most powerfully felt on Earth all year. Ascension energy is amplified, and our 5D reality is coming in powerfully. It may feel like you're under the pump right now. In fact, you've got so much opportunity to break out of old habits and feel free. You're doing so well. We're all feeling your project progress. Keep reaching into soul's direction. Now you can check more, learn more about this on elizabethperu.com forward slash the tip off, where I believe she does a daily tip off forecast. And the next one, she'll be teaching about the 14 days of this intense cosmic rectangle. Now from Lama Surya Das, New Millennium Prayer. This is a prayer for the new millennium from a high Lama of Tibet. May all beings everywhere with whom we are inseparably interconnected and who want and need the same as we do, may all be awakened, liberated, healed, fulfilled, and free. May, be the, may there be peace in this world and throughout all realms of existence, an end to war, violence, poverty, injustice, inequality, and oppression, and may we all together complete the spiritual journey. Uh, for the Dream Spell Journey by Valon Votan, and this is for yesterday, Kin 54, the Lunar Chamber of Timelessness, for September 2019, NS1.32.2.13, Kin 54, White Lunar Wizard. This is for yesterday. The code I polarize in order to enchant. Stabilizing receptivity. I seal the output of timelessness. With the lunar tone of challenge, I am guided by the power of death. Harmonic 14, self-existing output. Express intelligence of form. And now for today's catch up on the, the dream spell journey. Today for... September 5th, 2019, Kin 55, Welcome, Galactic Season of the Eagle, 45 Zolkin since the Harmonic Convergence, 1987. Today's Kin 55, Electric Eagle, 3 Eagle, opens the Galactic Season of the Eagle, which, which represents the root elements of the blue sky. In the Dream Spell Count, the four tribes of the Polar Earth family, the sun, serpent, dog, and eagle divide the Zolkin in four equal parts called the spectra, or galactic seasons, 65 days each, equaling 65 times 4, equals 260 days. Each season recapitulates the transformative power of the root elements, yellow fire, red blood, white truth, and blue sky. The Electric Eagle, Kin 55, activates the galactic season of vision. This is also the time that I have spoken about in the past, about the prophecy of the eagle flying with the condor, the eagle of the north with the condor of the south, which is the divine masculine flying with the divine feminine to activate, awaken, and uplift all life in all realms. Today's Kin 55 also marks 45 Zolkin, 45 galactic spins equals 45 times 260 Kin. Since the first day of the legendary Harmonic Convergence 1987, invoked by Jose and Loydeen Arwellis, Valon Votan, and Balon Ilk, they issued a call for the 144,000 human beings to gather near sacred sites at dawn on August 16, Kin 55, and August 17, Kin 56, to open the doors to the final 26 years of the 5,125-year Mayan Great Cycle, an era of unprecedented change in the preparation for a new evolutionary cycle on Earth. The Harmonic Convergence 1987 was the first synchronized global meditation in human history 
and it set the beginning of the new age as a social movement. The milestone of 45 Zolkin since the Harmonic Convergence 1987 points out to number 45 equaling 9 times 5. Number 9 represents the solar consciousness and number 5 symbolizes the fifth dimension of prophecy, exactly the number of the Harmonic Convergence's Kin 55. 11 times 55 refers to 5D, fifth dimension, the prophetic dimensional shift of 2012 to 2013. 5 September 2019, NS1.32.2.14, Kin 55, Blue Electric Eagle. I activate in order to create bonding mind. I seal the output of vision with the electric tone of service. I am guided by the power of self-generation. I am a polar kin. I established a blue galactic spectrum. Also for light workers, love workers that are in Michigan and the Detroit area, Patricia Cota Robles from Eraofpeace.org is having a free event on September 15th. That'll be Sunday, September 15th. So that'll be in between the 14th and the 17th to help activate this this final breakthrough energies. It will be in Novi, N-O-V-I, Michigan, September 15, 2019, Sunday, 10 a.m. to 3.30 p.m. This will be a free seminar for all lightworkers. So if you feel called to and this resonates with you, you can check it out on airofpeace.org. So thank you all for joining me here today. Thank you for sharing your experiences. Let us know in the comments below what you're feeling, seeing what you're resonating with today, any synchronicities. Be sure to subscribe to this channel. Hit the little bell next to subscribe. People are saying that'll help you to get notified when I put out my next video. I try to put these out daily with, what, with what's going on in the field. I'd like to thank the Divine 44 that have connected with me so far. If I haven't gotten back to you yet, I we had a much bigger response than was expected i've been working 24 7 to put this together this final mission and there's many things that have been manifesting since i activated the codes and a couple of weeks ago in the in the video that i transmitted on the divine 44 the sacred 77 and the blessed 10010 which will be fulfilling certain prophecies the support of the divine 44 is to help with this next grand mission with the eagle flying with the condor and more will be coming in the future on this so i'll be putting out a video hopefully in the next few days i've been so busy some major changes are happening in my life as as in most of yours it's 939 i'd like to also thank everyone that is joining us on this mission for the healing retreat center in ecuador we are using a cbd business to raise funds for this mission the vision is a healing retreat center with a sustainable community built around the retreat and the, the center for healing where you, you can join us on cbdpeaceoil.com. That's cbdpeaceoil.com. I'll put the link in the description below this video. So thank you all for joining us today on this another intense day of massive shifts and awakenings. Have a beautiful and blessed day. Beloved beings of light, I love you all.